Did you know there's a massive no-fly zone in Asia that planes almost always avoid? It's the Tibetan Plateau, an area so high and remote that it's considered one of the most dangerous regions for commercial aircraft. It covers over 2.5 million square kilometers, making it more than five times the size of France. One major issue is the lack of emergency landing options. There are only five airports in the entire region. If something goes wrong mid-flight, pilots have almost nowhere to land safely. The next problem is altitude. Tibet sits at an average height of around 14,000 800 feet. If a plane suffers cabin pressure loss, pilots need to descend fast, usually to 10,000 feet. But over Tibet, that's nearly impossible because the ground is already too high. Weather is the third reason. The region is known for turbulence, jet stream winds, and sudden storms. Mountain waves and thin air make conditions unstable, and forecasting is limited. Because of these three risks, no emergency airports, high elevation, and dangerous weather, most airlines reroute around the area. That's why, even on a live flight radar map, Tibet looks almost completely empty. 